Hey everyone, Brobbin here, and welcome to Salt 2 Shores of Gold, an early access survival game that is set to release on the 20th of September. I'm extremely excited to jump into this game, it feels like the game that I've been wanting for quite a while now. So let's just begin our journey in Salt 2. What the hell is that noise? Am I underwater? I mean, maybe that could have been CPR. It seems oh. the gods have smiled upon you today. There's a guy! A stranger in a strange land. I think he saved me. Adrift. Alone. Nevertheless, I'm afraid I must leave now. Alright, well, thanks Good for luck. saving me, I guess. Damn, that's a deep voice. Okay. <laughs> cool. Alright, so... I guess I was in trouble and this guy saved me and he has left, so... Welcome to Salt 2. Now let's go look at this table and pick up some stuff. We've got a sword by the looks, navigation tools, and a book. So this book's basically just saying that he's saved me and he has to go somewhere. And just up north, there's actually a cave with some good supplies. So we're going to be checking that out. North. We need to go this way to find the cave. All right, let's go. This looks like a cave entrance. Yep. Cool. Looks like we've probably got some copper here as well. Very good. Okay, how do I get in here? Ah! <laughs> the entrance, how about that? Alright, let's go. Got some bananas, some money. Most of the entries in this journal are illegible, except for the final notes scribbled hastily. I found a cave. According to my sources, there's a hidden alcove with treasure in here somewhere. Apparently a breakable boulder of some kind. Ooh, okay. I hear something, like, growling. So there's probably an enemy in here that we're going to have to take care of. I think I just got everything I need to, uh, build a raft. <laughs> oh! Whoa! Hey, hey, chill, chill, chill. Okay. First enemy of the game, and quite easy. I did lose a third of my health. Alright, now I've taken care of the enemy. I'm actually going to try and rush through this a little bit. I've got a new recipe. Wanderer's boots. Oh, okay, cool. So I've got some some gear we can craft. I've got to find this boulder. Oh, I see it. You see in there? Oh, yes. You've got to hit it. Sick, dude. Item talents. Many equipable items such as armor and weapons have talents that you can customize. Interesting. Oh, there's a nice little cooking station. Cooked bear. Bear meat, I think that should say. It's just cooked bear. That's funny. I need yellow flowers. Aha! That is the last ingredient I need to make some health potions. So let's do that really quickly. Also, some of this, whatever this is. Alright, let's make a health potion. Awesome, I think just the one will do. Let's make some cooked bear as well. Uh, let's just use all of it, honestly. Alright, let's see if we can make the raft now, shall we? I can... A wave skipper, I need a little bit more copper. And wood planks, and I don't know how to get wood planks, so we're gonna go with the standard raft. I think he's supposed to anyway, so that is now done. There it is, look at that. I've got a raft! Okay, sick. Hey, you. Come on! Yes! More food. Never even thought. Let me see if I can do some mining. I can. Awesome. Copper ore and flint. Okay, so we're going to be using the raft and sailing to a seaport. So we're going to go and find a town, I guess. I'm here. Aha. So I need to go south, southeast, or just southeast will probably be good enough. All right. I think I have to go to this island. It's, it's more down here, actually. So let's just use the raft. Aha. That's the anchor. Okay. All right, cool. So... Let's head over this way. This is so cool, man. I don't think this base building, I think this raft building. I think you live on a raft. This game has some great potential. This could be the stranded deep that I've always wanted. Aha! That's the island I'm going to. There's a lot of islands around here. This is so cool, man. <gasps> I think I see the town! It's right up ahead. I see it in the trees. Look at that, man! Civilization! Alright, and we are, in fact, here. Sick. Alright, let's uh, raise the sail. I guess we stand still now. Let's edge forwards a little bit, actually. Cool. 
I think this should just stay still. Don't hold me to it. Blue water refuge. All right, let's uh, let's find the guy. What's this? The workbench? <gasps> a bow. Cartographer, I found you. Hello. The bigger the ship, the better the sailor. Why does that sound like Arnold Schwarzenegger? All right, cool. So this guy right here just gave us a quest to go and fetch his favorite compass. Some pirates stole it off him. So in return, I'm gonna get the materials needed to build a brand new, better ship. Seems pretty fair to me. I'm gonna chill around here for a little while, make some health potions and prep for this, maybe make a bow. And in the morning, we'll head out to the pirates. All right, it is now morning and I just accepted a quest from this guy over here as well, which is a part of the Maruda faction. I think I'm pronouncing that right. Basically, they are contractors that go and kill pirates. So, this guy has asked me to kill a pirate captain as well, so hopefully I can do two things in one. I'm gonna try and find my raft now, wherever that thing is. It looks like it's drifting away. I think it has, you know. <laughs> That's uh, rather dangerous. Not quite sure how that happened, but hey. All right, let's figure out where we've got to go. I've also got this chest that I can place on the boat here, so... There we go. Sweet. Ship storage coming soon. That is not yet in the game. Got ya. I kind of wish I made some armor before <laughs> setting off. But that's, uh, it's too late now. We're gone. Okay, here we are. Let's find these filthy pirates and take care of them. Why did I not make a bow? Oh, I'm so dumb for that. Oh well, I guess we'll have to figure something out. Okay, three pirates in total. We've got two over near the edge of the cliff, one over here, who's on... Who's on guard. Great. Well, let's try and take a stealth approach to this. We've got one guy over here, and then another one just somewhere over there. Let's try and... <gasps> oh. oh my god, my health. Luckily, I made lots of health potions. You know what? Let's just go. I feel confident in taking these guys down. Okay, not bad. Cartographer's compass, I think that was. Hey, you. Are you blind? Are you actually blind? Thank you, hello. I love that you can loot so much stuff here. At the village, obviously you can't loot it because it's a friendly place. And that would just be stealing, but this is warranted. <laughs> I can probably make a bow right here, actually. You know what? Just, uh, don't worry about me, guy. I'm gonna make a bow real quick. <gasps> oh my god, my health, man. Uh, okay. Heal. Oh. Okay, you can dodge the attacks quite easily. Good. So, it looks like here we've got a classic Skyrim dungeon. This is the way back to the entrance. And we've got to work our way through. That's so sick, man. Oh god, I'm getting proper Skyrim vibes from this, except like in a survival-y way. <laughs> I'm picking up a lot of weapons and stuff that I don't really know if I can use, but I'm hoping... My plan is that I can sell it. That would be the best thing right here. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. And that's the basic bow, too. Obviously, these are early game enemies, but I'm excited. Pirate captain's key required. Okay, cool. Well, I'm glad that I accepted that quest from the other guy. Hopefully, I can do two in one. Ah! Oh my god! Are you just roaming? Jesus. Dude, it feels like I'm playing Skyrim, but just a, like a, a survival game. I don't know how to describe this. This is so weird. I think it's the, the music. Oh. Yo! Uh, uh, uh. Okay, sick. <laughs> that was easier than imagined. From what I can tell so far, there's no weight limit either to what you can carry, which is very refreshing. I love just being able to carry stuff. It's so good. 
Oh my god, that's the captain. Oh, heal. If I can take out that one. Good. Very good. We just got the warden. My stamina. Thank you. Was that it? How did he do so much damage to me in the first place? Okay, cool. Well, let's go, uh, <laughs> let's go open that chest. This one, here it is. The pirate captain's key to unlock. This will consume the item. Yes, please. Wait, a map to where? Battlemaster Island? Whoa, I can make a, an amulet and a lot of cool stuff. All right, sick. Yep, we're back here and we can now leave. Very spooky place, very cool atmosphere. That was a great experience, man. Well, luckily, my ship is still here. That was one thing that was quite concerning in the past. Do I push this? How do I get this unbeached? Ah, I figured it out. You can just replace the raft. Dude, that's so annoying. I've been here scratching my head for about 10 minutes. Oh, well. Right, let's go back and complete these quests, shall we? If I can take a look, I can also... You can see I've got these two quests. Captain killed. And, uh, yeah, two quests in one. That's so good. Let's go. So the mercenary, or I guess the guild guy, um, the deed is done. Are you ready to join? I do want to join the guild, yes. I now have a rank of novice. It's time to find our headquarters. Cool. All right, another quest. Let's go and hand in the compass, and hopefully I can build a brand new ship. As promised, here are enough supplies to build the wave skipper. Wave skipper craft. That is so sick. So this guy is selling workbenches and stations, which I will use for crafting. I can place these on the ship that I just crafted. So luckily enough, it looks like I do have a lot of copper because I've been looting like crazy. So I think I'm just going to buy one of each, honestly. Let's do the basic workbench, the station, the cooking station, the forge, weaving, and woodworking. Okay, let's take a look at my inventory. There it is. Used to deploy. Hell yeah! That is a big ship. Okay, cool. I wonder where other ships there are. Let's head up. Look at this. It's a blank canvas because obviously I can play stuff on it as I want it to, so... Uh, let's actually take a look at my workstations, wherever they may be. Let's get the cooking station and place this right at the front. That's everything down. Uh, actually, just the forge to go. Let's place that in here as well. This is rather large, so I don't really want to have it outside obstructing views and stuff like that. Let's see if I can, I can craft some stuff here. I can make charcoal. I've got a lot of copper ingots to make. I'm just going to craft all of that. <laughs> I'm not sure if I should have done it, but hey. There's a lot of really cool stuff you can craft here. An ebony pickaxe, ebony ingot, gold chains. Dude, there's so much stuff in this game. Find the Marooner's headquarters using the map in your inventory. Cool. Wow, that is a long way to go here. Northeast. All right, let's uh, let's go. I've got to actually lower the sails, and then we can go. Anyhow, that's unfortunately all I've got time for in today's video. If you enjoyed Salt 2, don't forget to press the like button. If you want to see more Salt 2 on the channel, make sure to let me know in the comments below. I'll be reading through those quite thoroughly because I really, really enjoyed this game. I can see this getting very in depth, and honestly, it could has potential to be my favorite survival game right now. All right, well, hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll catch you next time.